Mount Sac is located in Walnut, California, and uh, the school itself is approximately 400 acres uh, with additional parcels um, off-site, so right around 500 acres. Yeah, the campus is, is split just um, through a major street, and so south of Temple Avenue is our athletic facilities, and the north of Temple is uh, the main campus. So in 2021, uh, I did I did notice a post uh, about USC being Green Zone certified, and so that sparked my interest. Um, in talking to USC, we got in contact with AGZA, which is American Green Zone Alliance, and uh, we started that relationship. Um, and ever since then, we've been doing a series of trainings, you know, trying to implement and make the transition from gas to, to battery powered equipment. The transition that you know we had envisioned was coming from the ground up. You know, it came from our department saying, "Hey, we want to make this change." Um, now, you know, there are mandates coming down the line where uh, gas-powered equipment is no longer being available or utilized. Um, but that was a change that we initiated from within. So I think with robotic mowers, uh, I initially thought that, you know, there was a little more uh, technical um, aspects of it. Um, don't get me wrong, there are technical aspects, but it is uh, a little more user friendly than I expected. So some of the changes that we've seen in our operations since we ran the mowers is, you know, the quality in the cut, and it's also freed up time for our personnel to do the more detailed tasks that we had to have time to do. Some of the key features of Nexmo, um, I believe, are the safety aspect of it, you know, with all the sensors that come with it, um, and then also the, the ability to track it and really monitor it while it's in operation. You know, being able to move it wherever, whenever, um, and, you know, versus a dedicated mower. The assumption that the robots are taking jobs, um, I, I receive that from students all the time, you know, while we're out and about. But within a few minutes of talking and letting them understand, you know, what the purpose is and how it can help, um, that's definitely changed.